and we're back. I was a little bit in the dark. Sorry, looking like a hood, like a hoodlum. But it's cold as shit. It's 30 degrees. Oh no, it's my oil life. <laughs> so much oil I had. My bad. It's uh, what is it? It's 34. I wasn't that off. Ah, uh, I don't want to look like a fucking idiot, but it's kind of too late just when you look at my face. You know. It's 4:50 in the morning. Monday, December the 31st, ending the year strong, just like we start every day, just like uh, we're going to start the new year, you know, with no breaks. Uh, I'm still on vacation, but I don't believe in days off when it comes to uh, going to the gym or uh, your comedy or your art or whatever that is that you really aspire and dream and, and working on on to be. Um, yeah, consistency. That's what today is about. It's just about consistency. This whole last week, I got so much done. Oh, it's been the best. The, the last week, uh, first one week, one of two of vacation. And um, I just stayed. I just, I had a staycation. I just stayed at my house the whole time. And um, it's my pre-workout. But, uh. Yeah, I'm just super thankful, super happy, super excited, super motivated. I'm all, all kinds of pumped up. May have been a little bit rude. Should have uh, should have asked if you were thirsty. I'm just joking. I know I'm talking about myself to a fucking camera, but it's good. I think do it not just uh, if somebody were to do like a podcast like uh, Devin Clark does, which is really great by the way. Um, or if you if you do some sort of a, a video or just something you can get your voice out and talk nonstop, it, it, in my opinion, actually even more if you do it solo, um, I think it, it does. It transitions over to uh, to stand up really really well because uh, you continue to flow and get your thoughts out all at once and stuff like that. So, uh, but yeah, that's just like a secondary thing. What's going on today? So today we got the gym, almost there. Uh, it's 24 hour fitness, but for some reason, uh, 24 hours doesn't mean on Mondays. Yeah, it doesn't open until 5 a.m. on Monday, but whatever. It's the actual uh, last day that I am going to, or tomorrow is actually the last day that I'll be going to this gym because there's one about half the distance. So you know what? That's 10 more time, 10 more minutes back in my life that I won't have to drive to get to the gym. Usually drive like 20 minutes to get there. Um, one thing I'm going to do different, no break dancing. Yeah, I'm not going to be break dancing at the gym today. I was actually, I actually hadn't break dance, didn't break dance in like five years or something like that. Um, but it's all like just body motions and stuff like that. And I knew I could do it. So I just cracked out a few windmills and did some other stuff. Doesn't matter. You probably wouldn't know what, what I'd be saying if I said it anyway. Um, but uh, what else is going on? Yeah, gonna get home. Gonna work on some more writing, more comedy stuff. If there is open mic tonight, um, I'll definitely be doing that. And uh, I'm actually gonna try to make a new open mic spot, depending on what these guys say at this uh, at this bar nearby and stuff. I think we gotta have more spots in the, my local area. There's a couple. There are. But there's more in Dallas. No hate on Dallas. I know a lot of people do. I don't see why. Why are you gonna hate the city right beside you? It doesn't make any sense. So, I do notice that people are a lot nicer in Fort Worth than they are in uh, Dallas. But if I go back to D.C., people are a lot nicer in Dallas than they are in D.C. So, anyway, don't have a whole lot going on ever had is a beautiful day today be thankful for what you got and work hard for what you want this isn't a motivational speak speech um i just uh I'm, I'm it may come across like that like i'm trying to be like motivational or something i'm not i'm just motivated i'm motivated by life you know if i wasn't motivated i wouldn't be here in the morning that's not completely true even when i'm when i'm not uh that's when I talked about like work ethic and stuff. If you're not motivated about something, but it's important, you got to supplement your fucking work ethic behind it because you don't always want to go to the gym. I kind of wanted to go today. You're not really, but it's important. Routine is key. 
So I hope everybody has a beautiful day today. Um, there's not really anything else going on. I'm just focusing more on uh, everything that I don't usually have the time to do. Having a day job, which is just working on comedy more and more writing and more organization and more rehearsing and and all that stuff. I love the whole process from writing to being on stage to thinking about new bits to working on them uh, at the checkout line or the random person or shit like that. So 2019 is literally going to be the best year ever. 2019 for me is going to be the springboard year. And what I mean by springboard, it's like the, uh, pretty sure that's what it's called. But like the uh, the thing that you jump into a pool, right? I'm not. I'm pretty sure it's not the word actually saying out loud. It doesn't sound right, but it is because I'm because uh, 2019 is everything leading up to 2019 has been like a uh, it's been like inertia. That's a science word, but basically it's been like built up momentum uh, for what's next to come. 2019, it's kind of like, you know that expression, how people say uh, it's all downhill from here? That doesn't make any sense, because that means that you've already reached like a height, and now you're just going down. But in my opinion, it's more fun to go downhill than it is up. And uh, yeah, what I'm getting at is 2019 is going to be the year that all my practice, all my studying, all my writing and everything is all gonna come to fruition. And it's just gonna be the beginning. But kinda like uh, an avalanche, that momentum is gonna continue to build up and that will be the beginning of the new. I'm, I'm saying right now, I'm calling it out, 2019 is the year when everything begins to change in a dramatically better, significant way. All the practice, all the, all the effort, all the writing and everything is going to a whole new level. And I'm not just saying it, I'm doing it. Uh, actions, actions without words is meaningless. That's why I even, uh, just dropping some knowledge, uh, Jesus was performing miracles. And he didn't say my exact words. I would never say that, I'm a Christian. But he did basically say that... Um, or maybe it was Mary, but anyway, uh, you gotta you gotta perform these actions so that you're remembered. Um, because not that your words aren't enough, not exactly that, but uh, checking to see if the gym is about to open. Oh, fat boys are on. Good stuff. I don't always listen to rap. I love house and EDM, all sorts of stuff, rock, country, whatever. But, uh, yeah, 2019, I'm telling you, if there aren't enough words in a dictionary, and there aren't any words that exist to create the sentence that I'm trying to say now, which is, basically, in short, watch me. I'm telling you, 2019 is the year that everything is going to be uh, moving into place. I'm doing a lot of shows. I'm going to be doing a lot of traveling. I'm going to be getting gigs. And I'm going to be taking opportunities and moving everything onto a new level. Uh, it's like I said one time, if you watch all my videos or some of them or whatever. But uh, I don't really believe in that expression like tools to, in the toolbox, like kind of taking them out when you need it and putting it back when it comes to like a skill. Or I, I work on levels. What I mean by levels is it's kind of like a flagship always moving up and always moving forward, you know, cruising out. I really hope the gym is open today because if I've been taking this fucking pre-workout when the gym's not open, I'm going to have to be like running in place for 60 minutes because it is not good to have in your system. Um, so enough is said. Time for actions. Have a beautiful day, everybody. I'm excited, motivated as fuck, and um, I can't wait. I can't wait till tomorrow. Man, 
it's happening. So have a beautiful day, everybody. Thank you for your time. I hope you liked this video. Do something big today. Do something hard. Do something challenging and conquer the shit out of it. And then find something harder tomorrow. Have a beautiful day. I love you all. If you like this video, please subscribe to the link right here. If it's on YouTube, if it's Facebook, you can hit a like. I'm Benja. Well done. NWA is on. Damn. Sorry. I'll mix it up real quick. I'll show you. See what's on my EDM channel. Not that great. Should have ended it where I did. All right, y'all. Have a beautiful day. Gym still isn't open. Something's suspect. Something's going on. I really hope it's open today. Don't be tricking on me. All right, guys. See you. Thanks for your time. Bye-bye.